Hi Clarence. Hi Hi Charlie. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hi Leo. The boys ready to go? Let's go outside. Go on, boys. Everybody go pee -pees. Come on guys. Let's go pee -pees. Come on boys. Let's go pee -pees. All right, so every morning I give them a uh, few treats to start off their day. This is how we do it every morning. Okay, clear. Here we go. Charlie. Jump me. All right, that's enough for treats in the morning. Now, the Bulldogs will probably go back to bed. Depends, if I'm hanging out in the kitchen, they will hang out, they'll stay up. But you can tell they want to go back to sleep. I usually put the TV on for them, just to give them some kind of noise so it's not quiet. So bulldogs, they get a lot of weird gunk in their eyes, in their wrinkles, everywhere. So now we gotta clean the gunk out of their eyes. Clean the gunk out, doesn't bother them. Charlie's always clean. Yeah, clean Clay Clay's eyes because Clay Clay always has a lot of gunk in his eyes too. Gotta get the stuff out of the wrinkles. They don't really like it. They prefer just to keep it, but I know it's good for them. Now we're gonna fill up their water bowl. any of my business. So it's 7.50 and I'm filling up the water bowl again for the second time. You guys wanna go for a walk? Come on guys, you wanna go for a walk? Yeah. Alright, so it is 9.30. I just woke the dogs up. I'm gonna take them for a walk now. They love going on walks. So, let's see how this goes. Come on guys, let's get your leashes. Over here. And the fun begins. There's a certain skill to walk three bulldogs at once, let me tell you. All right, so we just got finished uh, with our first walk of the day. I usually give them two walks. It's crazy because they get really wore out really quick. Being a bulldog owner, you know how to regulate, you know, their activities so that they're okay. If you notice, I only took three bulldogs out on the walk because one of my bulldogs, he's really lazy. His name's Chunk. He's our oldest one. He's not that much older than him, but he's just a very lazy dog. So he was just hanging out. Come on, Chunk. You want to come out? Come on. Come outside. All right. Well. That means it's nap time again, so they'll go to sleep for a little bit, and then we'll wake them up and we'll do something else with them. So. All right, so it's now 11.10, and the bulldog nap time continues. These dogs sleep so much, but they're so cute when they sleep. Hi, Chunky Man. Hi, Chunky Man. <laughs> All right, so they're still sleeping, so we will check on them in a little bit. So it is now one o'clock, and just brought the guys outside to go to the bathroom. They also love laying in the sun. It's like their favorite thing in the world. As you can see, Chunky already started. He doesn't care if it's dirty or not. 
That's where he hangs out. Now Charlie, I call that the Augie Simoncini position, aka the Superman. I want purple ghost. Now a job that comes along with owning four bulldogs is cleaning up. Four bulldogs comes two poops a day. That makes eight poops. Now if you times that by seven, that's 56 poops a week. So I gotta get to work. That's a lot. All right, I have a little surprise for the bulldogs. Watch this. Boy, sit, sit, sit. Do you guys want to play with the ball? <laughs> I think that's a yes. No! So that lasted about three minutes till they popped the ball. Did they flinch already? Hi right, boys, inside. Let's go. All right, it's time to play with Leo's favorite toy. As you can tell, he loves a frisbee, and he's nuts. He is so crazy. <laughs> he's probably the most energetic bulldog <laughs> you've ever seen in your life. You ready? <laughs> Alright, so that's enough playtime. It's kind of hot out today still, so I'm going to bring him inside and get him some water. <laughs> and we're having all this fun, and here's the Chunky Man. We're going to cool down now. Everybody's going to relax. Too much fun for these guys. So there's a time every single day when the sun sets through my front door. This vase that Lisa got puts these little speckles all over the place, as you can tell, on the walls, on here, on the ceiling. And Clarence goes absolutely nuts. He's already focused. If you move the vase like this, he goes absolutely crazy. That's how obsessive these bulldogs are. But the sun sets in like five minutes and it goes away. And Chunk just can't be bothered. Okay, I'm just waiting for Lisa to get home and I'm gonna feed the dogs. Uh, she's leaving work right now, so she'll be home in a little bit. So I can feed the dogs and that's pretty interesting. All right, it is now time to feed these bulldogs. This is their favorite time of day. They love eating, as you can tell. I mean, they're kind of chubby and they got a lot of rolls on them. So this is their favorite thing to do. I'm dead sure of that. But it's a process to feed the Bulldogs. It is not an easy thing. First of all, we have to take Charlie and we have to put Charlie in a separate area. Come on, Charlie, come over here. Now, Charlie eats on his own because he does not like people going near his food. Well, Bulldogs going near his food, so we feed him separately. Now, we're gonna feed Chunk and Clarence. Not sweet to at all. So now we're going to feed Leo, and now this is the complicated part. Leo, he can't control himself. I don't know what's wrong with him, but he's nuts. We've saved his life twice now. We've actually reached down his throat and grabbed the pebbles out of it and got him breathing again. So I have to feed him very carefully. Okay, ready? All right, I just finished feeding the dogs. Now I am going to let them relax and digest for a little bit, and I have a surprise for them. I'm gonna load them up in my car and take them to the skate park tonight, so we'll check back in in a couple hours. All right, so we are in my car. We are taking all the bulldogs to the skate park for a late night session. They love going there. They love running around on the ramps. They love chasing my bike. My wife is with us. Say hi, Lise. Hi. And we are going to the skate park. That's what's awesome about having your own skate park. You get to bring your bulldogs there. So let's go. All right, so we are here at the Incline Club, my family skate park. We brought the Bulldogs out. We are going to just run around and let them have some fun. Right, boys? Oh, buddy.
Go ahead, Leo. Good boy. Good chunky man. Go, go, go. Yeah, so that's a day in a life with the Bulldogs. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know they did. They had the best time ever, so. All right, maybe we'll check back in and we'll do another one sometime soon. So. On behalf of Chunk, Clarence, Charlie, and Leo, we are out. Good night.